Take one. Hey guys, only been seven months. I know, you've missed this face. Anyway, let's get back to it and pretend we haven't been apart for time, okay? Um, what we're gonna do today is some simple collars. I mean, mum's wiggling a butt, that's a sight that I'm never gonna forget. Um, anyway, so, um, we're gonna make some collars today for some shafts. I've been looking on YouTube and there, there isn't too much of this about I was looking what's the most repeatable and simple approach especially when you're using manual machines so a lot of these you'll see is actually what's known as a split collar so a lot of these split collars is when you're in hard to reach places or stuff like that you'll actually split the collar using the mill and um, a slitting disc and then you'll actually place it over or what's known as a spring uh, spring collar I think I'm saying that right spring collar <coughs> baby shark um, anyway so what we're gonna do is just a simple shaft collar so all it's gonna do is it's gonna be 20 mil inside we're gonna do that with a H7 20 millimeter um, reamer I think I think that's gonna be the best fit either way it's not gonna to matter too much the reason being is because you actually have a grub screw in it or a gib I think that's what the US call it um, and what we're going to do from there is we're just going to do that, tighten that around the collar and Bob's your uncle, Fanny's your aunt kind of thing. So we're going to go for that. Um, let's get the lathe, let's get some material cut, let's get the um, lathe running and let's make a video and let's see how long it takes to get on YouTube. Yeah? <laughs> Enjoy!
why it's great because I can always see myself in that camera. I think we focused. Yeah, anyway, so I hope you all enjoyed that video. Do you know what? These turned out absolutely brilliant. Doing it the way I did, I couldn't fault it. Um, used a good old girl for the most of the big drilling, that 19mm drilling, Jesus. Um, I was dodging a few of them to be honest with you. I don't know if you saw well obviously you saw it, but yeah, I was I was dodging a few of them. <laughs> but yeah, uh, that turned out absolutely brilliant. The the old little girl as well. Um she did great for you know the odd bits and ends with a three jaw chuck. Mainly I prefer using a collet chuck if I'm honest. But it's always handy to have the two. They were absolutely brilliant. They do exactly what they need to. I think they look very nice as well. And you know what? Really happy with that. Um, it definitely. They, do you know what? They, I, th I think they cost about three quid. I'm not lying to you. I, I think they're about three quid or something like that. So instead of spending all the time, you might as well just buy some, aren't you? But I, to me, they just. They, they're just not that nice. So I thought, well, do you know what? Uh, it's, a, it's a nice project. So I might as well just build some, aren't I? You know, build over buy. It's up to you. Um, but I just wanted to put something on YouTube, something that you know not many people have done so to speak even though it's something that's you know, simple um but yeah i'm probably rambling on too much already so hope you all enjoyed this video if you have don't forget to rate comment share and subscribe it really helps if you like this video like if you didn't dislike even though i just said rate but anyway down below there's all the links so you know social media all that sort of stuff go check it out support me and I will see you in the next one. Have a good one.